Stampede went into a paddock and up towards it. Well, hello everybody, it's uh, Suffolk Andy. Nice uh, afternoon here on the cold side, but uh, doesn't seem to be affecting these swans. They're quite happy to put the legs in the water, aren't they? So, how can I complain, eh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I don't know. Just went for a little ride down to Harridge. One of my favourite little spots we've been here loads of times, but when the water's up, it is... Uh, very nice here at Manantry. Can I make my way back now? Let's uh, have a little ride. Well, we're now coming through uh, Manantry. Like I say, we've been here several times before. Famous really for witches and stuff like that. Witch, witch finder general was in this area. to get so much uh, a hanging uh, I did actually read somewhere that at one time he'd earned a thousand pounds altogether for having uh, witches hung or whatever uh, it was nearly a million pound in today's uh, in today's money a thousand pound in them days would be equivalent to nearly a, a million pound just short Unbelievable, but there you go. What greed will make you do, eh? Greed, greed, greed. I think what I'm going to do is uh, just just have an hour, really, about things what are doing and things what are happening and things what are doing, things what are doing, boy. <laughs> I better not go back into. Uh, the Suffolk dialect too much because uh, on my last log I said Suffolk Andy got droned. A lot of people thought I said Suffolk Andy got drowned. So <laughs> rotten buggers taking the piss out of my my poor old Suffolk accent. Proud of it. Should always be proud from where you come from, where you was born, what country you always be proud. I'll nip my way around to sort of Flatford Mill way. Uh, and go home that way. They come back into Suffolk, from Essex. I spent spending quite a bit of time in Essex at the moment. I think I'm going to take the scenic route, route back. Let's say we just have a little chin wag. Well, what do you think of the drone? A lot of people said they loved it. You know, that really intrigued me until I knew the price of the bloody things. A basic setup with a decent drone and uh, controls and camera and everything like that. You're talking six hundred pound, uh, and that's not top of the range. That's a half decent thing, but not top of the range. They got the thousands. Um, but wow, some of the footage I've been watching uh, one or two channels, had a look at one or two drone channels. Some of the stuff is outstanding. But apparently uh, there's a lot of rules and regulations. When I was talking to the young lad who was uh, who drove me, he was telling me some of the uh, regulations and there's quite a few. And uh, in a lot of places, um, especially uh, like America and places like that, there's there's quite a, I don't know, quite a restriction on them. Restriction, yeah. And there's here as well, there's all rules and regulations. But you know, you can't sort of enjoy yourself at all, you know, if you like a bloody e cig or something like that. There's no rules and regulations if you like the drone. But I could see with the drones, I suppose, if your next door neighbour used to, you know, like getting in a garden topless or something and you start sending one of them up, or I suppose that wouldn't go down well. I suppose. <laughs> right, we're now going into East Burgholt. Constable Country. I'm going to get past this fucking slug. Thank 
cute. Oh, don't they drive you? Don't they drive you? Oh, us bikers, we've got no bloody patience. That's the trouble. There was no bloody patience. And the trouble is, I transfer that over to my car. I don't know if you lot do, but I do. I get in my car, I'm so bloody impatient. Oh, does my head in. Some of these car drivers, they just don't know what they're doing. They're so slow, they can't make up their minds, they're indecisive. And I'm like, do it, do it, do it, you know, overtake that, do it, do it. You've got plenty of room, you know. But they don't, they just, oh, fuck it up, 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 shit myself, shit myself. And you're like, for fuck's sake. Oh, God. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to stop up here anyway and have a bloody good vape. Yes. That's what I'm going to do. You go down there to Flatford, where the, the he ween was painted. Look, all these people, there's so many people turn up this area to have a walk around and, and whatever. It is a beautiful part of the world, there's no doubt about it. No doubt about it. Yeah, I might have a look at them drone things. If I can pass that past Mrs. P, I might have a, might have a little delve in there, but uh, uh, this might be uh, a boy's toy a bit too far, you know what I mean? It might be, but uh, I wouldn't spend that sort of money without, uh, without informing her first. <laughs> She's, just, she's usually okay with anything I want to do. She's a fucking diamond, really. But sometimes... <laughs> oh. There's room here. I'm going to stop and have a vape. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, look at all the flowers are out, look. Surely spring is here now, even though it's bloody cold today. But, lovely to see all the flowers. Right, I'm going to have a vape. I'll be back with you in a minute. Well, I've had my little vape. Had a little walk around the church. Here at Burgel. Time to go home, I'm afraid. I tell you what, sometimes you're you're out on your bike and you're having a lovely time, you know, and you're enjoying your ride, and you really don't want to go back. You know, you just want to ride and ride and ride, you know. But you can't have it always, I suppose. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, now. Oh, they don't look, do they? Let's have a bit of fun.
I think that's enough ramblings and whatever for me. All right, safe. Love each other. Suffolk Andy.